everyone welcome to the course of satellite communication in today's session we are going to know about origin of satellite communications so before getting into the origin of satellite communications we need to know actually what is a satellite okay we have already so many times come across a word called satellite we have seen many times this communication throughout the world or outside the world is happening because of the satellite only right okay so to keep it in a technical way a satellite refers to a machine that is launched into a space and move around the earth or another body in space okay so it can be anything okay if at all it is launched into a space or moving in a space okay around any object right now if we take an example of a satellite which is human made okay that satellite is designed to revolve or move around the earth similarly if at all any object in a space is rotating around another body in the same space okay so that also can be considered as a satellite okay so coming here for the satellite which is human made this satellite is referred to a machine that is launched into a space which moves around the earth okay or another body in the space so is to keep it simple a satellite is a small object that orbits or revolves around a larger orbit in space okay so it can be a man made or it can be natural so let's see what are the different types of satellites so coming to the types of satellites there are two types of satellites one is natural satellites another one is artificial satellites okay let's first get into the natural satellites the satellites which are existing naturally in the universe they are called as natural satellites for example a moon as well as earth can be considered as our natural satellite why any object as we have discussed earlier any object which is revolving or moving around any other object in the space okay can be considered as object can be considered as satellite okay right so let's see how the moon and earth become okay natural satellite okay so earth is a satellite because it moves around the sun okay and moon is a satellite because it moves around the earth okay so earth and moon can be considered as natural satellites coming to the artificial satellites these satellites are man made and these are sent into space and are moving in the orbits such that for the purpose of uh, communication so if you see some of the um, satellites which are man made or artificial sputnik score intelsat etc etc are different types of satellite so in the coming classes we are going to see different types of artificial satellites as well okay so initially if you consider a definition whenever any object in the space is moving around other object that can be considered as satellite okay so these satellites are subdivided into or categorized into two types natural satellites as well as artificial satellite natural satellites are nothing but which are naturally existing in the universe and we can consider our moon and earth as a natural satellites as moon will be moving around the earth and earth will be moving around the sun okay as they are moving around the one another okay they are considered as natural satellite coming to the artificial satellites artificial satellites are man made satellites majorly used for communication purpose like sputnik score intelsat etc they are many more uh, satellites which are artificially made for the communication purpose like weather forecasting telecommunication services etc 